What's up everyone? Today's video, I'm going to be cooking dinner. We're going to be making parchment baked Greek salmon and zucchini with salty feta. This is out of this super simple half-baked harvest cookbook that I have been trying to cook out of here on my channel. So I'm like cooking through the whole entire cookbook here on the channel so that way I can try all the recipes. This is supposed to be a really easy recipe where you're pretty much just putting all the ingredients in parchment paper and folding it up and then baking it in the oven. So we're gonna try it out and see how it is. The total amount of time for prepping and cooking is less than 40 minutes. So this might be a really good fast meal for you to have on hand anytime you are like really busy or busy weeknight where you need to just throw dinner in the oven. All right, so first off, it says we need to preheat the oven to 400 degrees. We're gonna go ahead and do that. Make sure I don't have any like cast iron pans or anything in there. All right, this is the salmon I had picked up. So I, I'm not sure, it's supposed to be four pieces, but this might just be able to be cut in about three. And then we're also going to need some zucchini and some lemon and feta and I forgot, Kalamata olives. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead. I have this um, mandolin, which I believe just came from like Amazon a while ago. And we have to slice a potato and the zucchini like pretty thinly so that way they cook well. Okay, so we're gonna slice potatoes first. All right, I just have some parchment paper here. And we're going to layer these in the middle of the parchment. Then we're gonna season these with salt to the zucchini. Okay, and we're gonna put these on top of the potatoes. And place this on top of our zucchini and potatoes. Okay, now we're gonna drizzle with olive oil. Also gonna do more salt and pepper. And just top with some lemon. And Okay, this is what they look like. I'm gonna fold them up so that way they can steam properly. So I'm going to pull both sides up, roll it down. And fold these under. go we got our little parchments all together and our ovens ready we're just gonna go ahead and put them in they are supposed to cook for about 18 to 20 minutes so we'll just have to see I'm not sure if I have more ingredients in mine than hers but we'll see how long it takes okay turning off the oven I just pulled them out and I opened this one because I wanted to see if the potatoes were done and the salmon was done and it all looks Perfect, actually. Way better than I even expected it to be. I just have some leftover salad and I'm gonna do an avocado and some pickles for our plates. Just top it with some feta and parsley. I'm doing this one for the picture and then I'll put it on the plates. This seemed to turn out really, really easy. I'm gonna go ahead and put it on the plates so we can taste it. All right, we got the finished plates. Looks so good. This stuff you don't have to taste, just the- Well, this is the same salad from yesterday, right? 
Yeah, because it was left over. Okay. But the salmon and like potato, zucchini mm -hmm. dish is the important part. Very good. It tastes like really like white and healthy. Mm -hmm. But I got fresh fish instead of frozen, which I think makes a really big difference. Yeah, I think that definitely does. It was also really easy and cooked really fast. Yeah, I love that one. Okay, that recipe was a really great recipe. Super easy, Alvin loved it, I loved it. It's definitely really healthy compared to some of the other recipes I've made so far. So you could easily make this a weeknight meal and not get tired of it. You could even change up like what fish you put in there if you get tired of salmon, but we loved it. I need to do that way more often. So quick, so easy, so refreshing. Let me know if you make it, if you've enjoyed any of these recipes and these cook with me videos, and I will see you all very soon in another video. Bye-bye.